I am Anthony Salvatoriello. Work for the company Philips. You know, Philips is a for publicly traded institution. We need to maximize profit. A really good way to maximize profit is to put the, you know, a lot of the responsibility onto the customer. And the supply chain allowed it, you know, because it's, it's cheaper to just make a new device than try to refurbish, which is why we have such an amazing opportunity now, especially with COVID-19, showing that there's real value in trying to be circular. So we found out that mostly in the U.S., the idea of doing circularity is absolutely possible. We just need to create the partnerships for it. We already know we can do this already with large uh, you know, equipment that Philips already provides, MRIs and CTs. Those are really easy to refurbish. That's a very obvious model. There's a lot of value there. We're focusing on fetal monitors. These are just a couple thousand dollars. There wasn't really a value or a push for that because of things like COVID-19 really messing up supply chains, really wrecking the old ways of working, which was very linear of a make, sell, it's the customer's problem to now, well, actually, we probably could have even used those resources ourselves as Philips. Perfect opportunity for circle economy. Philips US internal systems, they're set up to take in those devices. They know those devices. They know where they are and how they work. The infrastructure is all there. If you, the refurbishment process, it can be done in the US. Within the United States, I think we're ranked like 33rd for infant mortality. So the average infant mortality rate for the United States is about 5.8 per thousand. In context, the Netherlands, I believe, is like 3.6. And one of the big reasons for that, unfortunately, is that there's a lot of inequality to the access of care. And when you look at infant mortality, the biggest reason for that is usually what happens during pregnancy. If the monitoring was there, we could actually literally save lives. I love the song Circle of Life for, for our solution. I mean, when you think Circle of Life, generally you think of the chorus. Do the circle economy movement, Circle of Life. But on top of that, the Lion King, it's, it's the birth of Simba. So it's literally, we are allowing, giving that chance, that access to care for women to be able to actually to give birth. So we're literally helping to give life. Knowing that we're creating an actual, a brand new ways of working for Philips is very, very touching. Uh, and also the, just the scalability. I mean, we're just starting with fetal monitors. The, there are so many other monitors and so many other products that Philips provides that we can create circular that also can save lives in their own way. One, one thing we're hoping for, for a future is we no longer do manufacturing of goods that the actual manufacturing sites just become refurbish, repair, uh, recycling sites instead. Uh, so that we don't need to make anything anymore. We already have all the resources we need to make the things that we need. <laughs>